I'm Nina Sperano at the UW Green Bay campus. The universities of Wisconsin released a report revealing major financial challenges across all 10 campuses and announced a plan to eliminate structural deficits by 2028, claiming most universities were spending more than they were bringing in. However, UW Green Bay quickly fired back saying their finances are solid and continue to grow regardless of the third party report released. According to the report, the research shows a decline in state support, decline in enrollment, inflation, and other factors have driven the universities of Wisconsin system into financial distress. The report is urging immediate changes at seven of its campuses. The report states strategic investments and rising expenses have led to a deficit threatening future success. Today, the UWGB chancellor was quick to defend its financial stability. I would ask you to look much more carefully at each institution. So we are the universities of Wisconsin, but each institution within the universities of Wisconsin has its own financial reality. The universities of Wisconsin financial report details a $2.2 million deficit this year. But according to UWGB, despite a dip in financials last year, it's reporting strong numbers six years in a row. Unfortunately, in the report, everyone's going to look at that one chart that is also uh, a um, a moment in time, but it's the current time. Now look at where we are, look at where we're headed this year and look where we're looking into the future in our finances. It's a very different curve. It's an upward curve. We asked one student if she noticed changes on campus. Some professors also leaving here and classes are also been cut. A lot of programs have been cut. I think the theater program was cut too, or not the whole theater program, but like certain classes and things. Mm -hmm. So that's like what I've heard. The universities have already taken steps to address deficits across the system in the next decades, including layoffs and voluntary buyouts for some UWGB employees and realignment of academic programs at UWO. But the UWGB chancellor says UWGB's financial future continues to grow. We're exceptionally proud of the work that the faculty, staff, and students are doing here at UW-Green Bay um, and continue to be proud of how fast we are adapting. And that is why we have such a positive outlook of where we're going, why we continue to grow, and why our economic outlook looks really positive. It is important to stress that each university within the system has its own financial story. For example, UW-Madison, part of the UW system is not included in the report due to its strong financial health. If you would like to read the report for yourself, I've posted it on our website, NBC26.com. In Green Bay, Nina Sperano, NBC26.